Hi, everybody. It's me, Erica Crafty. How's everybody doing today? Well, today it's kind of cold here where I live. It's been cold, warm. Well, some days are warm, some days it's cold. I would say today is cold. I'm really struggling. I'm trying to keep warm. That's why I'm all, like, cozied up because it's kind of cold today, but I know I'll get through it. All right, today I'm coming on to do a review of 2022 goals and what I've learned in 2022. And then um, Yarny goals again for um, 2023. So let's start with the recap of 2022. Um, the review of 2022 is the things I've learned was I learned how to make a be uh, basic beanie, baby bibs, and pocket scarves were the three main things that I learned. Um, I did four craft shows. The best sellers were my lovies. Um, I made five blankets for Christmas. Um, first time putting things in the craft share craft fair. I did a hat with um a pom pom that got four fourth place. Um, I did a table runner that was third place. I did a baby blanket and that was um third place. And let me see, my lovey was second place, and I also made a rainbow poncho that was second place. Um, I do have a video of my craft fair things. You can see it's in my playlist. Um, and that's about all for 2022. So my goals for 2023 is to learn new stitches. Um, my also other goal that I try to reach in 2022 that did not happen, that I'm hoping that happens this year, would be amazing if I finally got to reach a 1,000 subscribers. Um. I've been on YouTube for a couple of years now. I've been really hoping to reach that. It's just taking me longer than what I thought to reach it. So we'll see. New year, new goal. So my goal is to reach the thousand. So we'll see how I do. And then my other goal is to post one, one to two YouTube videos a week. I admit I don't do that right now at all. At least one to two. Sometimes I'm lucky to get one or I go every other week. Almost it varies. Um... The other things I'd like to do in 2023 is I want to learn how to make a star blanket. I've never done that yet. I've been watching tutorials on that. I also would like to do a 12-month blanket with different stitches in each month. So that, that would be kind of cool. Um, I would like to make myself a shawl. I have never done that. I've done shawls for other people or I've don I donated shawls like to Rose Likes to Crochet for her wings. I've donated shawls for that, but I've never made a shawl for myself. Um, I would like to finish a poncho for myself. I started one, but I did not finish it. So my goal is to finish it. The other thing I would love to do in 2023 is make a, was it, 2C2 two two corner to corner blanket. I have never learned the, what is it, 2C2 two two stitch yet. I want to learn it. Just got to watch it and review and figure out how to do it. I would also like to make a sunflower blanket because sunflowers are my favorite color. I'm not sure if I want to do like granny squares to it, stitch with it, or um, to make all little granny sunflower squares and then sew them together. I'm not quite sure how I want to do that right now. And then I also want to make a 4th of July blanket, but I think with the 4th of July, I want to learn how to do it in the star stitch or make the star granny square. So I think that's about it for 2023 and 2022. Nothing too crazy things I know I think I can accomplish. I mean, I learned new stuff last year. I should learn new stuff this year. And we'll see what 2022 brings. Hopefully a lot of happiness and goodness. And we'll see. I mean, I don't really plan on... I did really good last year. I didn't buy too, too much yarn. I mean, I bought some. I don't know if any of us can really go without buying any yarn. I've been using my staff. It, my stash using what I have and I think the only time I'm really going to buy yarn is if I'm at, I need it to finish a project or I need it for a project maybe if I'm going to sell something or not sell something so we'll see where that brings us but I'm not going to just buy yarn for fun either because I have plenty to use in my stash I really need to use up my stash this year all right you guys um let me know what you guys are planning. Let me know some of your ideas and some of your things that you're planning to do in 2023. All right, you guys, that's about it for now. I will talk to you guys again soon, and we'll see you later. Bye.